Hey there guys, how you doing? It's Drew here and today is day number 1402 and my brain is not with me today. I don't know what is going on guys. I think it's because I haven't ate anything all day. Um, I woke up to basically responding to people for hours and hours on end today. So I haven't ate anything yet. I had like a little, which I don't drink coffee, but I was like, I got to get my brain up somehow. So I drank a little bit of coffee because my wife drinks coffee. So I just kind of stole some of hers. Um, but yeah, I'm not really with it today. I'll, I'll say that I, uh, had one attempt at the video here and I was listening to it and I was like, I don't even understand myself. So, <clears throat> so yeah, I might be a little off in this video here today, but if there's news that needs to be said, then, you know, I feel I need to say it for my team and such. Right. So, uh, we'll get going here. Okay. So we're going to do a lot in today's video. We're going to answer the questions that I could not answer because I didn't know the answers for them. Um, from yesterday's video about the uh, exchange there, the new uh, bot uh, exchange, all the information that's came out. We now have the English presentation, which I have right here on my desktop. I still haven't had time to go through it, guys, but today I'll go through that. And then in tomorrow, uh, in tomorrow's video, maybe I'll talk more about what's in that. Man, I'm losing my freaking voice. So let's delete these. We don't need those anymore. And we'll get going uh, uh, with this. Okay, so I've got, as I said in yesterday's video, guys, I'm going to make an investment in the STD um, S crypto there. So that'll finish me off for that investment. It's going to be over, like it'll probably be close to 35 times. We want, okay, let me copy this. We want 180 uh, days there. Okay, looks good. Make that 180 days. There you go. Okay. So there's that and grab the code and there you go. So I'm going to go over like there's tons of stuff I'm going over in today's video, guys. I just want to get this investment here out of the way and that'll be basically it for my S crypto guys. So let's see where it's at. It should be. Yeah. Okay. So it's at 33.5. So that's roughly where I thought it'd be around is around 35 or so. Right. Okay. So that's pretty awesome. That makes me happy. I've kind of completed that. And, um, you know, through this, uh, uh, time here, that's, that's pretty good. And I know that over half of that is commission, right? That's, that's nice. Okay. So we've got this that I'm waiting on to go through. So let's refresh the page. Let's check, see if it's gone through. Cause I made a post in 15%. Nope. Have they responded back to it? Asking them to push that through. No, they haven't done it. Okay, maybe they're ignoring me because they did put up up here about 45 messages above um, saying that they're really busy today and to not ask to push withdrawals through unless they're over $10,000. This one's uh, uh, $63,000, so I thought oh, I'll ask them to push that through, but they're, they're not doing it. So we'll have to wait for that. That might be in tomorrow's video, guys. This is not my funds. This is a teammate's funds. Uh, one of the guys on my team there and um, he can't use S trade, so uh, he wants to sell the STD that he's made back into um, SWCT to put it towards his uh, holdings there, right? Okay, so I'm going to do that. Well, I guess it'd have to be in tomorrow's video. So we're going to shoot on over here. Uh, I want to talk about this really quick, guys. So this here, this like 1200 bucks almost, these are the funds, all of it, <laughs> That that's it, guys. Um, that I'm going to be allocating towards everything to do with the bot trading. Okay. So this will be my funds. I need to purchase the bot, which is probably going to be about half of that. I believe the bot purchase is from 500 to a uh, $10,000. That's how much the bots are roughly going to cost. I believe. Okay. That, that information it's probably in this PDF, which I haven't had time to go through yet. Right. It's probably in here and tomorrow I'll be able like, I'm going to go through here uh, today when I'm done this, and then I'll verify all this, uh, tomorrow about exactly how much stuff is. But, uh, I think I saw something in the, uh, one of the, the groups there, guys, I think it was the 14% group that the bots are 500 to $10,000, like to purchase the bot. And then I don't know what that's based upon. Like, is the $500 bot, is it a high risk bot? And there's no settings to it. I don't know. Is the $10,000 bot, it has full settings to it. I don't really know anything about it yet because that news has not came out guys. I think they're saving most of the news 
about the, you know, the nitty gritty details. I think they're saving that news for the, the event in Dubai. Um, that makes sense to me because that's where they're launching it from uh, there, right? So this funds that I have here, guys, that's going to be my funds because I'm on a budget, of course. Uh, that's going to be my funds to get involved with the trading bot and everything involved with that. So even the pre-sale of the token for that exchange, um, you know, which I'll take the profits from that and put it back into uh, the purchase of the bot, the funds that I need to have to trade on the bot, all that kind of stuff. Okay. So I thought I'd record all this in video just so that people can see like my plan. This is what I'm doing. And also this goes for, you know, this is, it, it'd be part of my promotion as well. Like if I have all this recorded and say, for instance, I take this 11, $1,200 there and say, I don't know, maybe in a year from now, I've turned that into, I don't know, like, I don't know the result because there's no result yet. Right. But say I turn that into $80,000, then I can actually make like a sales funnel, promotional content, whatever off of the content that I'm actually making right now. Okay. So there's a kind of a nugget for you in marketing is just freaking document everything you do. If you do that, and things work out for you, things are successful, you'll have something to fall back upon that is actual proof. You can say, hey, look at this. This is where I started, okay? So this is where I started, <laughs> okay? Like that, like I'm sitting here saying, you know, the same thing when I started S Group. I had like, you know, my goal was to get to $5,000 in the first month. Like, what am I sitting on right now? And this is just my account. I have my wife's account as well, right? I'm sitting on... I think almost half a million in commissions and bonuses, like pretty close to it. Yeah, like another 4,000, 5,000 bucks in sale in uh, commissions and bonuses, well, commissions. And I'll be sitting on half a million dollars there that I've made through S Group through commissions and bonuses, right? Uh, in the investment there, um, I've got uh, 276. I've got another 93,000 in my wife's account, which is... Uh, you know, my $50,000 bonus. Um, it's, uh, I, I put 30,000 or 25,000 or something out of pocket, um, into that account as well. Um, and then I think my $5,000 bonus or something's in there, uh, as well. So, you know, all of that, you know, I think it's about $1.4 million in earnings guys started from a $5,000 goal investment, right? My first investment was a thousand dollars. And then I got that, that or sorry, not $1,000, it was $100. If you go back and you watch my first video I did. Um, and that $100, my goal was to get to $5,000 the first month in the first 30 days, no matter what, right? Like I didn't have $5,000 to do this the first day I started, but I set that as my goal. So I have that content out there. So this here, guys, like this is, you know, I'm, I think I'm actually in a better situation, better place right now than I was when I started S Group because now I'm thinking like, oh, I can take this $1,000 or almost $1,200 to start with. Um, but all this will be recorded online. And if this is successful for me, I can go and I can use this as content like in the following year or years or six months or three months or whatever type thing, okay? So I recommend you guys... Do the same thing. Like, don't be afraid to go out there and just start something. Sure, no one is going to be looking at what you're doing when you first start. And that might feel like kind of crappy, right? Is that like, oh, I'm putting time into making videos and I'm doing this and it, oh, it's my time. And is this a waste of time? No one's looking at what I'm doing, you know? And then you might have like, I remember when I first started doing things, I noticed that the first people that were actually watching me were like making fun of me. They're saying like, I'm stupid. They're saying like, oh, you're involved in a scam or, or whatever. Not with S group, but like this was like 13, 14, whatever, 15 years ago. Um, you know, I was promoting some, I think it was some MLM company, like in Power Network or something like that. And they were like making fun of me, you know, kind of thing like that. And that was like my first audience was people that were like making fun of me. <laughs> so it's, you know, it's kind of a hard start. But in most cases, guys, that's kind of what you're going to go through is you're going to be like, no one's watching you. You have no audience. And the people who actually are watching you are like just making fun of you. Right. But then here's the thing is, yeah, this doesn't always happen to every single person, but if you keep on doing it, you keep on plugging away 
and you get a result, then you got a result, right? Even if it's like, oh, look, I made $100 online, but it was through commissions, you know, like it's a result, it's something, right? Eventually it happens. If you just keep on plugging away, you just keep on trying and you use strategy when you're doing things. You think about where you want to be. You think about what you're doing. You're not just blindly doing something because someone told you to, to do it, right? Like I had this problem with this guy that joined me in S group maybe two years ago. He joined me based upon that he was probably going to have the same result as me if he just copied what I was doing, like making videos, being active, you know, that type of thing. So every day he was making videos, but you know, he would send me his videos and say like, Oh, can you give me some advice or whatever? And he'd be sitting on his bed with no light and like mumbling away kind of thing. And it's like, yeah, you think you're copying what I'm doing, but, but you're not, I'm sitting here with a, you know, $300 microphone. I just paid $4,000 this year for this computer when I don't have $4,000 really to spend on a computer, but I understand like I need something good. So my videos aren't like crap when I'm trying to edit them. I got a little light over here. I bought off Amazon, you know, like I have a little desk. I have a, a room that I'm doing this video in that I do all my videos in. Well, most of them, sometimes I do them downstairs. Um, but you know, I'm not sitting in you know, on my bed in the dark like mumbling and stuff, right? So you have to use strategy, guys. You have to think about what you're doing, okay? So you can see this. I'm talking about, hey, I've got this little bit of money here and this is the start to something, okay? You, over the next year, you're probably gonna see my progress in this and based upon my previous results, it's probably gonna be some pretty awesome mind-blowing result, right? So if you've ever wanted to start something, guys, if you've ever wanted to like just kind of, you know, maybe copy what someone that is successful is doing, then, or I know I'm not successful at this right now because it hasn't even started yet, but in my mind, I'm visualizing myself successful. So that's how I'm going to talk, of course, right? So yeah, you could just watch what I'm doing, copy what I'm doing, but use strategy to it. Think about what you're doing, okay? Don't just sit there in the dark turn on your video and then, you know, mumble away at, oh, blah, 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 kind of thing like that. Like, think about what you're doing. Think about, okay, I'm doing this. What would people want me to do? What would they want to hear? What would they want to hear me talk about? That type of things, right? Okay. And be honest, like say, hey, I've never done this before. I'm just trying this out. I've noticed that a lot of successful people online, this is like how they get their start is they're just here and they're being real about things. You know, they're not trying to like, make stupid videos with Lamborghinis they don't have. Okay. So, um, like I just said in this video, this is all I have for this. That's it. <laughs> okay. But then I talked about that. I made like $1.4 million over the last, whatever, four and a half years or something with this company. Right. But you know, if you watch these videos, you understand what the company has been through this last year. And that's the reason why I only have this much to start. Right. Okay. So it's all, you know, guys, just be yourself. That's it. It's very simple. So Enough of me going blah, 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 It's been 18 minutes of blah, 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 blah. <laughs> okay, but we did do that investment, which is good. Okay, so we'll go here. We're gonna go to SPAD. This is the first thing. If you wanna be involved with this, you gotta do everything so you know everything, right? This is it. Here, the first thing we do is we become a part of the pre-sale of the token for the exchange. Okay, you don't have to do this to be you know, involved in the trading bot and all that kind of stuff, guys. But here's the thing. If I want to do something, I want to know everything about it so that if people are interested in what I'm doing and they ask me a question, I know the answer to it because I've been through it. So this is going to be $250 out of my pocket that I could just go put into trading. But I see this as more of a value because I'll understand how to do something. Okay. This is the same freaking thing that Sergi always talks about uh, is that when he started his, you know, internet uh, or not internet, he's not an internet marker. He's like a, a network marker, right? Sergi's the top guy in S group who's done like, I don't know how much he's done in, in sales. It, it must be insane. It must be. When he started his network marketing journey, career, or whatever, he was in the same situation as everyone else, right? He didn't have the money to go and uh, build and whatever. This wasn't for S group. This was something like a long time ago when he first got started, 
but he didn't have the money just to go and pay his way, basically, right? So he took the money he had, which I think he said was like $10,000 or something like that. And he went to that, whatever company he was promoting, he went to its event, its first event, and he got to know the leaders of that company. He got to know the owner of that company and he got himself really familiar with the people and the strategies that those leaders were using and all that. And basically he, for his $10,000, he focused on educating himself over funding his way, right? I guess it was some other investment type thing online, right? So, or it could have been offline. This, this might've been 20 years ago, we don't know. But I remember him saying something along those lines, guys, is that he focused on knowing the information for when he promotes and stuff over just going and dropping $10,000 in whatever he was doing. So if you don't have money, like right, right now, I don't have money, right? I've got $1,200 roughly to get going with this, right? Which in most people's eyes, that's probably enough. Like it's like, oh, I, I would do that too kind of thing. But this is part of it, guys, is I'm going to put out of that $1,200 or whatever it is, I'm putting right now today, 250 of that just into something I don't need to put it into, but I need to put it into to understand it, to go through that process, right? So that's that. I just want to explain that to you guys because a lot of people, they don't think like that, right? They're just going to think like, okay, all I need is a bot. So I got to buy that. And then I need funds to trade on. Okay. But if you take the strategy of selling what you buy, meaning getting commissions, you can take your whatever thousand dollars or twelve hundred dollars, whatever you're getting started with, and you can actually take that, record your progress, talk about it, be yourself, and you can turn that. As I was saying before, I can turn this, I don't know, twelve hundred dollars maybe into eighty thousand dollars within the year, you know, of doing this. Okay, so I want to share that with you guys because that's basically what's recorded of myself on S Group. That's what I did basically, right? I turned. The hundred dollars into five thousand dollars. Of course, I did out of pocket a little bit um, here and there type thing. But I basically turned a hundred dollars into what I have now is like what was it three in my account here three something three seventy or two seventy or something like that. Uh, yeah, two seventy six, and then I've got another ninety three in in my uh, wife's account there. So basically, I took a hundred dollars, you know and turned it into here and there, guys, I added funds out of pocket that I had. So that's, that's almost, uh, well, that is, uh, uh, it's almost 400,000. So we got three, like 370 there, right? Okay. So you could think about it that way. So my goal of taking like 1200 and turning it into 80,000 is, is it's, it's realistic. If you base, uh, those results, uh, if you base upon my results that I did with S group, it's totally realistic, right? Okay. So let's get going here. Let's do this. So I'm going to take part in this. Um, so 250 there. Let's uh, look at how this goes. So maximum 250 there. So I just, I guess I just put in 250. That's the minimum I can do. The maximum was like 25,000, I think, or 10,000 or something. And the number of tokens I'm going to get is uh, eight, 833. Okay. So also I'll need these tokens to like, I think I'll need them to use the exchange or something like that, or maybe I get a better rate or something, guys. As you can tell, I don't know everything about it. So it's like I'm recording stuff and I'll learn as I go, okay? So I'm gonna buy that, give me my code, grab the code there, okay? Let's see if they've responded to me yet. No, <laughs> it's not pushing it through. Anyways, I'll, I'll just have to wait for that. <clears throat> Get the code. And then the email code is just should be in my emails right now. There it is there. And pop this sucker in here. Did I even copy it? There we go. Okay. And then there you go, guys. I'm uh, involved in this now. Okay. Is it going to refresh the page or what, what happens here? Did it take it out of there? Did I even make that investment? No, I didn't. I didn't follow through with some. Oh, there it goes. Okay, so you guys saw that it jumped down to nine hundred bucks there. So we'll go back here and we'll see if it's somewhere in here now. Um, it's somewhere. Normally it says below or something like that where it is, 
But anyways, you guys saw that. I'm sure it's over here in transactions. Uh, no, it's not. Oh, no, there it is right there. Okay. Yeah, because I got 833 of them there. So I don't really know where the heck that went or anything. It doesn't really say in here. 833. Do we see an 833 somewhere? Oh, right there. Total tokens uh, purchased, 833. Okay, so I'll edit out all that of me looking where the heck it is and all that kind of stuff, guys. It's right here. So this is it right here. I've, it says I've already bought 833 of those, okay? So that's good. So uh, forward, go into here, and there's that. Put a little fire under that. And that's that. Okay, so get that presentation, guys. Go through it, understand stuff. You know, it's the best thing you can do if you're going to sell something or, or do something, right, is understand it. Anyways, we're not going to go through this today just because I haven't gone through it and I want to go through it um, after I make this video, right? So what was I doing? I was going and we were talking about this over here in 14%. Where's 14? There it is right there. So we're talking about this. So there is when you go so you sell the bot guys okay you got i think you have to buy i think you have to buy the bot to sell it so for instance if i buy the 500 dollars bot then i'll have availability to sell the 500 dollars bot and that's of course where i have to start off because i don't really have that much funds to do this with um but then i'll go i'll sell the bot i'll make a 30% commission because it's based upon, and I know we're going over some things that we went over in yesterday's video, but I'll make a 30% commission because I'm at 15% in S group. So basically in that uh, exchange, the bot exchange guys, you make double what you are in S group. Okay. So I'm at 15%. So I'll make a 30% commission from selling the bot. Okay. So I make a 30% commission from selling the bot. And then on top of that, I'm going to get a, a, a commission from every time that bot makes a profit. I would get a, we don't know the amount though, but it's probably going to be a, a little itty bitty amount. And that's what I was going over in yesterday's video under the investments here was that you can see how S group makes money. So you'll be making money like this as well, right? Every time you get, we'll say an investor or a client that buys your bot and then they start using it, you're going to make money off them using it. Okay. Which is insane. Like even if it's say 0.25%, still, if you sell say a thousand bots over a year or even a hundred of them or whatever, um, you're going to make some bucks, right? It's going to be awesome. Especially if those people go and they under, they realize like, wow, this bot works. It's great. And then they go and they buy the $10,000 bot in six months and they have, they're trading on a hundred thousand dollars and they're profiting, I don't know how much, but you're making, you know, you're making a percentage of the profits that they're making. It's insane, guys. Think about promoting something like that. That's crazy. And here's the big thing about this, guys. What is the number one complaint about S Group, right? S Group, I love their investments. Everything seems to be working out great. Everything has worked out great that's expired and all that kind of stuff. We've all profited. We've all made money in it, um, that type of thing. But what is the number one complaint that you hear from people? The, the, you know, it even, even it comes to the point where they're like, this is why I don't want to do this, right? Is because it's the same model from the outside. If you don't understand how it works, it's the same model as a Ponzi scheme, meaning you're, you're sending your funds to an address that you don't have control over those funds, right? In S Group's case, they're taking the funds and they're trading on them, you know, that type of thing. And then, and then, uh, their, uh, uh, a profit is created. You're getting a portion of that profit. The company's getting a portion of that profit, right? So from the outside, if you don't understand the structure of the inside of things, right, it just looks like a Ponzi scheme. Like if I was to tell you, Hey, yeah, uh, join this company here and you make a deposit and you're going to earn profits from your deposit. You, what would you think that is? You'd be like, oh, that's a Ponzi scheme, right? This trading bot system, how it's all set up, it's it's like this, right? You go and uh, things are, are, you know, you got the trading bot hooked up, it's trading, all that kind of stuff. You can go, you can stop out your trade, you can close your trade, you can, you know, decide, hey, I don't want to trade today, all that kind of stuff, guys. You can set the wrist, 
risk all that, right? You can do a withdrawal whenever you want. So what does that mean? It means that the funds you see in your trading account, you have 100% access to them, right? That is the big, like, I don't want to say downfall, but the big thing that stops people from investing in S group is they don't have full control over their funds. Okay. As you can see with this, if I go here to this investment here, which is already, you know, I could withdraw if I want, but we'll click on the withdrawal button there. And you can see for the first three months of this investment, I can't withdraw my funds. They're, they're stuck in there. And the reason behind that is because that's when the commission is made, the bonuses, all that kind of stuff for the people above you, right? Like that's the, you know, if you're on my team and you go and you put in a thousand dollars into S group and make a deposit and you say you put it into prime, um, I get a commission right away, right? From the company's, uh, profits that's been made and all that, but that, uh, goes back to the company. What I've made that goes back to the company over the following three months of profits from your investment. Right. Okay. So that's, you know, if you take that concept and you think about that, it basically means that's why you cannot withdraw for the first three months is because if you're to withdraw your investment over the first three months, the company would not make that commission, which it sent to the sponsor. Right. Okay. So knowing that, understanding that now you understand like, oh, okay. So the funds have to be stuck in there for three months. Okay. You get after three months, 30%, and then it drops down to 20%, then it drops down to 10%, and then it's 5%. So it's always going to cost something to get funds out of here, which, you know, if you go to your bank, if you ever had an investment in your bank and you've tried to pull it out earlier or whatever, they're going to charge you like the same thing. They're going to charge you fees and they're bigger than this. Like I had an investment through my bank for seven years and then I pulled it out. It was $21,000 and I got like $17,000 or something back. So they charge me whatever that is, 20%, like over seven years that they still charge me 20% or whatever it was kind of thing. Right. So, um, yeah, guys, uh, with this trading stuff, there's no fees as in for you to, where did I go? There's no fees for you to pull things out, right? Like I could trade one day in here, be like, yeah, I don't really like this you know, say you had a bad day, bad experience your first day. And you're like, I just don't like this. I'm doing something else that works better. I'm going to pull everything out and put my money into this other thing, right? You could do that. And it's not going to cost you 30%. It's not going to cost you, oh, I got to wait three months, that type of thing. So this trading bot guys, Basically, what is going on here is they've solved all these questions, these issues, these, you know, complaints from people about S group over the years, guys. There's a lot of those questions that are solved with this bot, right? It's still, you know, you you don't have to go in there and, and understand how to trade, right? You just set it up and it trades for you, Right. You can go and you can close trades out if you want. Like say, for instance, you've set it to the maximum amount of risk and the risk is it'll do a drawdown of, I don't know, 50% or 75% or something like that. And uh, the drawdown is at 25% and you get scared. You could go and close the trade out if you want, right? Okay, personally, myself, guys, how I'm going to do it is I'm going to just let it do its own thing and I'm going to use, that's why I have $1,200 to do this with, I'm going to use funds that going into this, I understand that these are funds for this situation. Before we end, guys, I want to just make this crystal clear because I did have two people basically say the same thing in the comments on my last video. Uh, is this guy here and then one other, I think it's this person here. So I'll go and I just want to talk about this because if two people say the same thing and I'm thinking that's definitely not what I'm, doing or trying to do or whatever, um, there's definitely a disconnect or maybe these people are just trolls. I don't know. Okay. So you can see here, funny how you're saying you want to help people, uh, who are not, uh, even on your team, uh, get on track, but then complaining about it. Guess it depends if you're trying to sell something new, a eh? understandable kind of thing. So trying to, I don't know what, what that guy's trying to say there guys, but what I, what I was saying in this video is 
it's not, if you're not on my team, it's not my job to help you. Meaning that, yeah, I make these videos, I put the content out, you can listen to them, you can take it in, you can think of whatever you want to think about when I'm, the things that I say. Um, but that's basically as far as it goes if you're not on my team, right? The If you're an S group member and you're not on my team and you're coming to me, messaging me, like personally messaging me, asking me questions because my telegram contacts in the video description, guys, my telegram contact, where is it? Uh, uh, right here. It, it says right here, like if you have a question before joining, it doesn't say if you're not on my team, message me here, right? So when you go and you look for support from someone you have not joined in any business opportunity, that's not what you want to do. You want to go and get support from the person you joined or the structure that you're in, like your sponsor sponsor or find the 15, what you should be doing, finding the 15% member above you and then getting support from that person. That person probably has a group that their team is in, that anyone who wants to be in that group, they're in that group and that person can go and, and you can directly message them through that group, which is a team group, okay? It, you know, supporting you, if you're not on that person's team, it has nothing, like, it's not my responsibility to hold you by the hand and help you out, right? Or, or, or you to message me every couple days asking me when liquidity is going to be provided. Like, it's, it's, it's crazy, guys, right? Absolutely crazy. So in this video here, I did talk about that. And I said that if you want support, you need to go to your sponsor, right? You need to look to your sponsor for support. Okay. And then I say things in this video, like, Hey, I'm, I'm saying this stuff to try and help people out. Like tell them about, you know, what Vadim was saying in the webinar. Right. Okay. So that was my point of view of this. You need to go get support somewhere else was that you need to go to your sponsor. You don't need to message me and ask me questions. Because think of this, if you're thinking of messaging me, asking me questions, and you're not on my team, think of how many other people are thinking the same thing and actually do it, right? And especially on a day where Vadim is doing a webinar and they're messaging me, like that's the uh, you know example I used in this video here was about 30 people messaged me before the webinar that were not on my team asking me what Vadim is, you know, what, what is he going to say? Uh, let me know what he's going to say you know, that type of thing, right? You should be going to the person above you that is at that webinar or is going to that webinar, which is what, 14%. And then later on during the webinar, we figured out it was 13% that could go, right? Okay, it shouldn't be some random person online that you're messaging, right? Like it's, 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 it's kind of crazy. So you can see here, this guy saying the same thing. Okay. This guy's actually makes a little bit more sense because he says, yeah, of course people are messaging you because you're giving information publicly. You know, if you, if you don't like people texting you, you better don't make videos. Okay. So, <laughs> you know, that, that makes a little bit more sense because I am giving out information publicly. And then people think like, oh, you know, I'll just go message this guy and, and he'll give me support. But still guys, it defeats the purpose of a sponsor. If you're just thinking, Oh, I'm going to just message this random person that I see online or that I see like, oh, he, he's publicly helping people out through a group, right? If I go and I, I decide, hey, I'm going to publicly help people out through a group, I'm not saying I want you to message me every question that you have and treat me as your sponsor, right? That's not what I'm saying at all. If I'm helping people out publicly through a group, right? I'm helping people publicly out through a group and, and what I'm talking about this group here, right? That's strictly through like the kindness of, I understand a lot of people do not understand what's going on. And if I understand something, I, I feel that I should help people, right? But not one-on-one. -on -one. This is not one-on-one. -on -one. There's uh, 769 people in here and I'm just putting in front of them what I know, okay? So I don't know where you guys are getting this. Hey, I, you know, I want you to message me. Like, I don't get that. Like, I'm not saying that in any videos. If, if anything, I'm saying not to message me. And I say it all the time. Right. Okay. And then this here, I don't get this, but he's thinking I'm only doing this to sell something. Right. Guys, you need to understand if you're not on my team, I can't sell to you. If, if you are interested in something that I'm talking about here and you're not on my team, 
then what is happening? You're listening to me. You're like agreeing with what I'm saying. You're like, oh, I'm going to give that a shot or I'm going to do this new investment or whatever, right? Am I saying that to make money off you? If you think about it, that's impossible because you're not on my team. Who would make money if you go and invest in something that you've watched a video of mine and you agree with what I'm saying and then that makes you invest? Who makes money? Your sponsor. <laughs> okay, not me. It makes no sense. Okay, so um, I don't know. I, I, half of this stuff, guys, when people complain about things and then I think about what they're saying, it's like, I don't, I don't get it. I just don't get it. Okay, and I'm sorry I don't get it, but that's it. Okay. So that's it for this video, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. It's um, <laughs> another long one, 49 minutes. I'll try and get this one down to like 30 minutes or something like that. Um, but yeah, that's it from me. And I'll see you guys in another video here shortly. Did I just make a whack of STD or was that left over from my investment? I don't really know. Anyways, I, I wasn't paying attention if that was up there when, after I made my investment. But um, that's it, guys. I'll see you. Bye-bye.